All right. So do we have? We have the suit on. Then we gotta go visit Lester. And there's also a mission for Franklin and Franklin's side. But let's do the mission for Lester first. Also, hello, by the way, after a bit of a hiatus. Uh, yeah. Yeah, no good radio playing. Okay. That was my fault. She's a biter! I'm trying to do police work here! That's assault on top of the shop lifting me. Man, the paperwork! What you packing? You know, standard LSPD issue 9 mil. Sweet. I gotta get some more. He's got my car! Okay! Hit the gas! Let's go! See ya! How many times has he said that now? Like five? You trying to kill me back here? Get us out of here! Relax, I got this. Go, 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 go! I'm on top of it. I do not want to go to prison! Don't worry, I know what I'm doing.
That's why every turn I take, they turn up. Successful truck. You're a bit of a failure, but hey, kudos for trying. Not that successful if you're in witness protection. Well, I've got an idea. Why don't we see what Agent Dave and the FIB think of this lovers on the run act? Where are you going? You know, I'm sort of thankful for this. Thankful? This is the worst day of my life. Ah, come on, you're doing your part. Your spending habits have got us into a sticky financial situation, so you're cutting corners. Really? My spending habits? I've seen your day trader account. Oh, hey, that's private. I swear, that's protection. It ain't even sacred no more. Give it up. You pissed our savings down the toilet. Really? Our savings? Yeah, our savings. I gave up everything to start this life with you, you selfish shit. Yeah, <laughs> okay, all right, whatever. Our savings. It's just, look, you can't look at the day-by-day -day figures. You gotta look at the overall, the... You know, the net figure. I've seen the net. It's a fucking disgrace. Hey, I'm bringing it around. Sure you are. Just please give me some warning before they repossess. It ain't that bad. Couple of weeks. A day, even. I don't want to be there. Honey, we're fine. Sure. Are we going home? Get rid of the car, Michael. It can't stay in the driveway. Oh, and yeah. Thank you. And now we can go do Lester's mission. talking about, pal. What you do's your business, bro. Anyway, 
Jay really got a big head once people started calling him a god. Guess you proved he wasn't one. They reintegrated my team in Burundi after the design got signed off. And now, my shares ain't worth dick. Sorry about that. I need work. And I thought maybe you could provide. I mean, I'm smart enough to track you down. Doing a stun shop while on the phone, that's lovely. I guess you are. Hey, I'll be in touch if anything comes up. Already? The hell is this place? Garment factory. I needed a job that didn't require me to do anything apart from uh, paying taxes. Okay, listen. What do you got? The Holy Grail. The Union Depository. Now they say it cannot be hit. It hasn't been yet. I just owe some Mexican hood a couple million bucks because I wrecked his girlfriend's house. I don't need to go crazy here. Which Mexican? Martin Madrazo. He's not supposed to be very nice. Oh, when I met him, he was charming. <laughs> so what do you think? Oh, um, let's see. Either we hit a bank in the sticks or we do a store. Which do you like? Well, <clears throat> store's usually easier. But I gotta make a big take. Well, gems it is then. Let's go to Vangelico, buy ourselves an engagement ring. Oh, we're gonna need a crew. I can round up some of the old guys. There are no old guys. Moses, uh, ironically, he found Jesus. Uh, all those Irish crazies, they mostly just disappeared. That crew from the south, they all went down. There was uh, an Eastern European guy making moves in Liberty City. Uh, he went quiet. Can they talk about Nico? <laughs> Well, we're gonna need a crew. You got any I never caught that reference until now. I've been working with someone, but they're too unpredictable. And I'll have to reach out to some other guys. The shop's on Little Portola. Your FIB buddies, they uh, know you're back in business. FIB buddies? What are you talking about? I checked out the WPP thing. Doesn't look like any WITSEC program I'm aware of. Well, for starters, they, uh, they don't put witnesses up in multi-million dollar mansions in Rockford Hills. Oh, okay. Maybe they thought this would be the best cover. And most witnesses don't transfer five-figure sums into a particular FIB agent's bank account every month. Of course, the money gets moved around and washed through a number of fronts, but the trail is there. Deposits and withdrawals, the same sum every month. Agent Dave Norton, white middle-aged divorcee, unremarkable career, except for one incident, the shooting of a notorious stick-up man, Michael Town. Yeah, 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 all right. Lester, I'm very impressed. Look, uh, we can talk about this another time. Uh, take these glasses. My eyesight's fine. They're fitted with a camera and a radio relay. I'm gonna run the operation from the car while you're in the store getting what we need.
Here we are. Hey, asshole, you just barged yes. into me. Whoa, you got the wrong guy. Go fucking <laughs> run. You reading me? Mm-hmm. Okay, we need shots of the security features, the alarm system, ventilation, cameras. That doesn't help. Go inside the store. Hey, beautiful. I need to pick up a little something for the woman in my life. But well, one of them. <laughs> <laughs> Sir, I'm sure we can help you. Tell me about her. What's her taste? Cheap. Thank God. This ain't my wife we're talking about. <laughs> I don't know. I don't want to spend too much. I'm thinking maybe... 10 grand? Our rings start at 8. Our pendants start at 12. All right. So these things built to last, or am I just paying for the Vangelico logo here? <laughs> no, 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 no. We use perfect clarity jewels. 18 karat gold, 950 platinum. Nothing but the best. All right. I think you just made a sale. I'm going to take a look around, think about it, come back to you, baby. Don't go anywhere. I understand. Okay. Thank you, sir. You got it. Come back to me. I was like, fuck this, I ain't paying that much. <laughs> so, we good? Almost. I need to get eyes on the roof of the building. See where the ventilation comes out. Drive us around the block. We gotta find a way up to the roof. Look, there. Some construction. Yeah, if they're gutting the place, I might be able to get to the roof. So, you keep up with the old crew? Well, after your death slash disappearance, there wasn't much holding us together. Yeah. You see him at all? After the incident? I kept tabs on him for a while. Needed to, uh, know that he didn't blame me. Yeah, where'd he go? North, south, east, west, wherever there were liquor stores to turn over and hitchhikers to disappear. Where did they bury him? They buried him? Not as far as I know. He's probably a John Doe then, right? What do you think? OD, shootout, maybe just a car crash, right? Stuck them down the ladder. Remains on the highway. They only knew what a sick puppy they had on Would their Would you hands. for... Mm. There we go. I'm on the roof. All right, use the glasses to get me a shot of Angelico's roof unit. It'll be right above the store. Is there a dog up here that I'm hearing? No, no, the air conditioning roof unit. Shut up, Lester. It's 
like a big box on the roof. Okay, capture an image of the system and we're done. We've got our shot of the Vangelico unit. Looks good. Okay, that'll do. Now come back to me before someone spots you up there. Will do. Here, take your glasses back. Let's go back to the garment factory. I called ahead and told him to start setting up the information. So, what did you see? Uh, nothing that'll cause undue complications. Yeah, it looked like a simple setup. Cameras broadcasting to a remote server. We might be able to wipe them remotely. Security guard on the door. He won't want to die for rich assholes to rub his nose in it. Good. The alarm system's linked to the door lock. We'll get a good window if someone talented hacks it. Anything else? Well, the uh, more valuable merchandise is in the cabinets in the center of the store, by the register. So I'd start there. Glass in the cabinets wasn't bulletproof, means you can smash them easy enough, but the stones will be in the safe at night. So, we go in when it's open then? Right. Once we melt down the gold, recut the rocks, that's an okay score. Yeah, shame we can't go in after hours, man. Those vents look promising. I might be able to flip that another way. I'm listening. Wait till we get back. About the crew. Yeah? There's this kid who's been helping me. Maybe we could cut him in. I don't work with amateurs. He ain't an amateur. Or if he is, he's a gifted amateur about to turn pro. He's a good kid, Lester. You know what they say. It's your funeral. One of them, at least. <laughs> a good kid that I'm going to turn into a big wig criminal. Here are the photos. The uh, workers have their uses. Okay, let me set this up. <laughs> nice to see the methods haven't changed. Well, we gotta figure out what we're doing somehow. All the crews, the rolls, prep work. Go and leave evidence behind on a hard drive. So yeah, the uh, methods don't change. Right, not for a pro. <laughs> well, mapping out the options, showing you all the angles. That's my area of professional expertise. But making decisions, that is your domain, my friend. Here. And there's two ways I see of doing this. We go in smart, or we go in loud and dumb. Remember the vents? If we're gonna be smart, we pump a little knockout gas through the air system, then hit the cabinets while everyone's out. You'll have to source the gas, of course, but crowd control won't slow you down, and that might improve the take. The cover is pest control, so no one will look twice when you're wearing gas masks. It means getting a pest control van, though. You go in dumb, and you'll need your, uh, famous way with people and four carbine rifles. But we can't buy them and risk them getting traced. No, 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 we've got to find some in circulation. It's awkward, it's, uh, <laughs> real awkward, but this is the gun favored by LS. PD tactical team, so one of their vans is probably a good place to look. A hacker can disable the cameras. The length of time depends on their ability. The alarm will be operating on the same window. The exit strategy is more or less the same for both options. The driver you pick will, of course, source some bikes. You come out of the store and make your way through the new subway tunnel they're digging off the Del Perro freeway. You lose the cops in there and meet a truck in the LS River. All right, I want my guy Franklin on the getaway. He can handle a bike. All right, if you vouch for him, I'll take the risk. So how do you want to do this? Run in through the front door or try to play it smart? Smart's always better. Ah, you've grown wise and cautious in your old age. Okay, select personnel with that in mind. As ever, the better they are, the bigger the cut. 
Now the driver, they'll source the bikes, lead you out through the tunnels. Eddie Toe. Now you can count on him to get you out of a spot. Guns. Now we're hoping to keep quiet, so this guy shouldn't make much difference. Gustavo. Gus Moda. He's a pro. Not much else to say. Hacker. Back office, but this is the person who will determine how long you get inside. This guy, Ricky. I met him at the Life Invader office. He may not be that good, but he's enthusiastic. Hey, it's just because she knows the system really well. Harris! <laughs> good. Feminine touch. She'll be able to find any back doors they got. If this is how you want to do it, I'll get moving. Great. Uh, I'll do some research on the pest control van and the knockout gas, and I'll be in touch. Oh, yes. Huh? Good. Good. I'll call you when everything's ready. You'll need to pitch it to the guys. Whoa. What? My rep don't count for nothing no more? <laughs> You're a dead man, Michael. I'll call you. All right. Hey, what's up? Hey, man, it's me, Michael. What's going on? Listen, um, I gotta get hold of the money for that house we pulled down, so well, I'm getting a crew together for, uh, you can guess. The pay will be awful and the risk will be high, but you might learn something if you're interested. Man, that's not exactly a great sales pitch, dog. but I guess I gotta start somewhere. Thank you. Maybe one day you could put together your own deals. Your own jobs. So, there's still some preparation I gotta do. Sit tight for a while. Mm -hmm. My buddy Lester will get in touch with the details. Imagine calling some random repo guy and saying, Hey, you want to steal jewels? You know how much this car costs? your linear entertainment go watch porn just go away shit fuck you what the fuck disrespectful little asshole i can't believe you did that that's my tv you don't talk to me like that i can't believe you mom was right about you you don't know any better and you can't help it but you're an asshole yeah well why don't you do something then besides just stand there why don't you hit me is that what you want to be hit by your son yeah no i just I want you to do something besides sit there eating. Yeah, great. Thanks for the fucking guidance, Dad. It means a lot. Wait. 
I'm just trying to help you. Yeah, well, nothing says I love you like smashing my fucking TV. Nothing at all. <laughs> I'm sorry. I just wish we could do things together. Hey, what things? I don't know. Uh, go for walks. Play ball. You know I have bad glands. Bike ride, then. Bike ride. You want to go on a fucking bike ride? Fine, fine, let's go on a fucking bike ride. Fuck me. We'll take a bike ride along Vespucci Beach, and I'll show you just what you want to see. Let's. I'm, I'm gonna have you walk to the beach, okay? You wanna, you wanna walk to the beach? <laughs> Come on, bud. Let's. Uh, let's. Where is he? There he is. <laughs> Come on. Come on. <laughs> you want to spend time with dad? You got to work for it, son. He's just walking right in the middle of traffic. Hey, ain't seen you down at the gym for a while. This day was going so well. Oh, that was funny. <laughs> change fuck yeah i'm a jam what's the big deal if anything goes wrong you can just fake your death and start all over driver's choice old man despot how am i to develop my own moral sensibilities when yours are so unbelievably fuck based don't push me seriously some guys borrow your bow borrow you were hiding in the head crying kidnap they just took receipt of your property with payment pending. If it was anything other than what you told me, then that's on you. All right. They fucking stole it. And who knows what they would have done if they found me. But I didn't expect or want them to get killed. You think I'm going to let some guys ride off with my son? Look, I knew you were a bad guy, but... Oh, a bad guy. A crook, a killer, a thief, a liar. I guess I've been all those things one time or another, right? It's just... What? <sighs> I always thought I was the good guy. God help the morally bankrupt planet your generation have left us if you're the good guy. Yeah. Anyway, I always knew you were the kind of person who didn't let other people get in the way, but I hadn't, like, seen that happen before. Yeah, well, that's me, Jim. And I've been trying my best to get things under control for the last ten years. But that was an extreme fucking situation. Here we are at the bike rental place. Please don't shoot the bike rental guy out of, like, force of habit. Hey, you. Two bikes. Take your pick. How you doing? This one will do. Hey, buddy. Hello. So is it like $10 for if a bike, then? you to the end of the pier, you're buying me a new TV. Crap. End of the pier, fine. But if you lose, you're gonna do something with your life.
I'm just living in behind in the dust. Easy. Ah. Looks like you're buying your own TV. You know, this is real nice, Dad. Bonding, good times. Yeah, yeah, I'm giving it my best shot. Come on, we're having fun, right? You wouldn't know fun if it sat on your face. Ah, come on. I mean, why do I have to hold your hand through this whole midlife crisis bullshit? And why don't you stick your nose up Tracy's butt sometime? Because Tracy doesn't buy cars she can't afford so that thugs break in our house. Tracy doesn't get kidnapped or destroy my yacht. Well, that's just because she's too busy getting fucked by dudes to get on TV. You don't talk about your sister that way. Well, I'm sorry, but it's true. I mean, according to her Life Invader page, she's hanging out with producers and porno guys this afternoon. What are you talking about? Actually, it's all happening right out there. What? That boat that makes yours look like a refugee raft? You know the kind of boat, the one that makes a young, impressionable girl drop her pants and spread her legs. This is the reason you brought me here, isn't it? You fuck. Ah! Dad, wait! Whoa! Ah! My head versus the water. <laughs> That was a botched die job. are my friends. Yeah, you're embarrassing her, dude. They're shooting porno here. They shoot porno all over town. Mom rented our house to them last summer. That was what? Your house? Yeah. Man, you gotta kill her pad, Mr. <laughs> Isn't it awesome? Hey, Let's go. Those walls to talk. You think I do it? Hey! No! Hey! Hey, cool, man. <laughs> what are you doing? Hey! Oh, hey. Oh, oh, see ya. I like that. What's problem? You're such a jerk. Come on! Dad, you dumbass. These guys are serious. Yeah, well, so am I. Talk to the scene of my fucking boat. Oh, motherfuckers. Get on. Now. I'm about to get you alive. No, you're not. See ya. God damn it. Go. Later, losers. Go! 
up, you pricks! They gave up. Fuck, 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 I think we lost them. Oh, I'm going to die. You see? They're gone. It's okay. I'll take you back to your brother. Okay? No, it's not okay. Not at all. Hey, we're alive, aren't we? Those psychos didn't kill you. Psychos? Only you could get me chased out of a party with effing guns. Drive us home. You ruined my life. Hundred and twenty six percent fastest speed. <laughs> Just back away. <laughs> Alright, great. 